Welcome to Bridgeway to History. I'm Michael Kanik. We're near the Aegean coast in Turkey at the ruins of Ephesus, one of the best preserved cities of the ancient world. Ephesus was first settled by the Greeks around 1000 BC, became established as a thriving port around 600 BC. However, it was during Roman times that Ephesus grew into a dazzling city of more than 250,000 and attracted immigrants from all across the empire. It flourished as the jewel among trading ports in the Aegean, and it was capital of the Roman province of Asia Minor. So, a great dazzling city, successful trading port, political power, what could possibly go wrong? Silt. Silt began to fill the harbor at Ephesus, and despite the efforts of the most skilled engineers of the day, to dredge the harbor, to rebuild it, to divert the river that flowed into it, the harbor at Ephesus silted up ultimately extinguishing the life of this once great city. So what's the strategic lesson for you, the organizational leader? A question. What's threatening your harbor? Despite how successful your organization is, how quickly you're growing, how wealthy or powerful it is, what's threatening your harbor? There are always, always potential threats. Could a key market dry up? Could your cost structure become uncompetitive? Could your technologies be overtaken? Your products become obsolete? Attack the assumptions that underlie your current success. Expose the weaknesses, both real and prospective. Then take action. While you may not be able to prevent your harbor from silting up, you may be able to reinvent yourself and continue thriving in a changing world.